Something's going on right now that has the potential to end very badly, and I'm surprised not more people are talking about it. Now, I know everybody's affected by the astronomical gas prices, and in fact, every time I drive by the gas station, it seems to go up by another 25 cents. But let's break this down even further and see how it might impact the job market. Think about how a farmer gets its food from their field to your dinner table. They're plowing their fields with tractors that are run on diesel. And that food is shipped to a processing plant via a truck that also runs off diesel. And then once the food is produced, it's also shipped by a truck to a distribution center and then eventually to your grocery store. With today's gas prices, it's costing trucks over $1,200 to fill up an entire tank of gas. And that's usually one full tank of gas per day. Think of the operating costs where just a few short months ago, it was one third to even one quarter of what it is today. And every single thing that's in your home is shipped by a truck. And even if it's not shipped by a truck, it's shipped by a boat, which runs off of diesel fuel, or a train, which runs off of diesel fuel. And they all have the same issue. If you think about it, there's not a single thing in a home or a store that you can buy that doesn't come from a truck, a train, or a boat. And as these gas prices continue to skyrocket, what's gonna happen to the price of your food? What's gonna happen to the price of your toilet paper? What's gonna happen to the price of lumber? What's gonna happen to the price of everything that you possibly could consume? And as prices go up, people stop buying. And when people stop buying, companies don't have as much revenue. And when companies don't have as much revenue, what happens? They start looking at layoffs and other ways to save money. And you look at the possibility that every industry could be affected by this, the outcome of that could be staggering. Now, I'm certainly not trying to be all gloom and doom, although this message kind of comes across that way. But what I'm asking you to is to think logically about what is coming down the pipeline if gas prices don't go back down again. It's time to start taking, getting yourself prepared seriously, start working on saving up some money, start setting up some multiple streams of income and preparing yourself for what could be a very ugly job market. I sure hope I'm wrong, but I'm just reading the tea leaves here, guys, and it doesn't look good.